So I was like, if I can't buy it anywhere, whatever, I'll just make my own. Yeah. So I made my own, you know, uh, me and my graphic artist sat there and, you know, did it and then uh, made it to where I liked it. And then we started printing them and wearing them. And then eventually I got the trademark for it. Hmm. By the way, for people who haven't seen the different designs, I thought it was really smart that you designed it in the colorways of popular colleges because it yeah. made it. So either people who are going to college or like younger demographic. Yeah, any, if you are, if you go to UCLA and are fan of me, you might buy it, you know. <laughs> And it's a good colorway. Shirts are 30, hoodies are 50. Over a million people have bought. Millions. Millions. In other words, you weren't one of these creators who waited until you were huge and launched a merch line. I launched my merch at about 500K and I did a week campaign and I made like 12 grand. I was like, dude, no way. I was trying to make two grand to get my down payment for an apartment. I actually made like a million dollars off that and then McDonald's hit us up and they were like, you got to stop. They're like, I was like, I don't understand. They're like, you don't, it looks very similar. I was like, I was like, I don't see the similarities. You got a call from McDonald's lawyers? And it, like they're the people that are representing this 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 thing that you know thing I sold, yeah.